Well, hi, and thanks for joining me here in my shop. I'm doing something, having a little bit of fun doing it, and thought I should uh, shoot a bit of a video here and share it with you. So, I just got curious about looking at a record under the microscope, and I thought, wow, it would just take me a couple minutes to get that set up. So I went ahead and did it. And you can see under the microscope is a, a uh, record here. In fact, there's two records. There's another one there. And so that's an old 78 record. And uh, what, I, what I've done is I've simply uh, taken a look at the uh, grooves on here. So I'm going to flip over to the camera here. There, that's the camera view. That's a little more interesting. And what we're looking at is the outside uh, area of the record where... Here, go right to the edge. Okay, that's the edge of the record. We come in. And the first groove is right there. So these are the grooves in the 78 record. Now, just to make this interesting, I have a hat pin. Just an ordinary run-of-the-mill hat pin. This one's been around for a long time. <coughs> the tip of it has a funny hook in it. It's a little bit distorted, but that actually means there's a little tiny, teeny pin on the end of this pin. You can think of it that way. So, let's take a look under the microscope. I'm going to try to lay this pin right in a groove right under the microscope here. So, it's harder than it sounds. Let's see. Here we come. Oh, there it is. Bingo. I've got it under there. It's floating. Oh, it looks like it's floating above the record. Okay, starting to get an idea how big the grooves are on this record. Yeah. There. Okay, so now I have the needle actually laying on the surface. Here, take a look. Let's see if I can just... Can you kind of figure out what I'm doing there? The needle's just kind of hanging on my hand. I'm not really holding it. It's a point down on the record. So what's keeping the needle there is it's running in the groove. Now you can see for sure which is a groove. But look at how big the point of this hat pin appears to be compared to the groove. Wow. Now, I'm going to take it away. I'm going to slide in a more modern 33 RPM micro groove a record. So how many grooves do you think you're seeing there now? Maybe uh, maybe 15 grooves across the screen. Let's put in this record here. And I gotta focus of course because it's a different depth. What happened? Let me turn the lights out. from having the uh, microscope uh, objective lens right up against the record, blocking the light. Okay, so there it is. There. So, uh, fantastic, hey? This is a really interesting image, I think. So, first of all, how many more groo grooves are there? Well, must be like double, almost twice as many grooves. Maybe more, you know, if we count them, maybe there's even more. And in these grooves, you can see the uh, the wiggles. And some of them, it's quite clear. Now, I couldn't tell you for sure if that's the high stuff you're seeing because it's rapid enough to show up within the period we're looking at on the screen, or whether that's a low stuff which is so hefty that you can see it. I don't, I don't know which way that is. Now, let me get my needle here, my hat pin. My hat pin, which I carefully put down, knowing it was an important component of what I'm doing. So I put it in a very safe spot. Here it is. Here it is. Okay, so I'm going to do, do the same thing, just let the needle kind of, kind of ride along on top of the grooves. There it is. Now you get an idea how difficult it is to keep a needle in a groove. Holy smokes. 
So the needle looks a little out of focus because it's, uh, or the pin rather, uh, because it's a little bit off the surface. Wow. It is tracking. Oh, oop, oop, no, just skipped. Oop. It's heading, it's heading, got a mind of its own. This is where it's going to go. We can look at the outer edge of this record too. So, there's the first one coming in. This is the outer edge. Mm, boy, focus was way on. There's the very edge, right there. Scratches everywhere when you look at it like this. It's not completely flat on my microscope stage, so as I move across the record, uh, that's interesting. Let's go up a little stronger here. bits of dirt there. Let's take a look at this big honking needle here. Oh, I must be moving the record. I'm touching it here with my hand. Hold on. very small spot on this record that we're looking at. There. Oh, it's just, it's not holding the groove at all. Look at it, it's just so fat, it's just running over the top of it. Wow. Now yeah, let's see if I can do something interesting here. Okay, so here's a uh, here, here's a cat. <laughs> okay, let's keep going on the microscope here. So, so now there's yeah, that's right, Spunky. You tell him. There's the needle. There's the needle we were using. I uh, was dragging over the record, and in fact, there's the micro group record right there. So there's the needle, the hat pin with the funny tip, which you can see quite quite clearly now. And then here is a record needle. Right there. Oh, that's a great view of it. Now that's a, pretty sure that's a 78, so it's a, it's a larger uh, larger needle. Now just imagine trying to make that needle, maybe the tip of it, go in those grooves. Considering what you saw with this one. Cool. See you later. Okay, 
so this is not this shot was not easy to get it took me a little while to set up here okay so that's that's the uh, that's the stylus that I'm using on my record player when I play records and now I'm going to try and uh, bring into the field of view the end of a hat pin and uh, let's just see how this goes there it comes Okay, after a fair bit of effort, I finally got both needles in view. I'm not holding either one of them. So, so let's see, we'll focus on the hat pin. I'm not exactly at the same height on my microscope stage, so I don't focus at the same area. So that's the needle. You can see the little tip there. It's twisted differently. The hat pin. Now we just look at the needle. You can see the needle is much finer. If you look at the general tip of the hat pin, and forget the little tip. Now the little tip is invisible to, to my eye, that's for sure. The rest of the tip, you know, you can see the end of a hat pin. It looks pretty darn sharp. I'll just look back and forget that little tidbit there on the end, the burr. Look back at the uh, needle. I mean, you can see it's really, really a fine, fine tip on that. There we go. Is that fun?